as a guitar player, this get like this gives me a headache. <laughs> Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Selamat bertemu kembali lagi di sini bersama saya di channel The Sacred Story Apa kabar semuanya? Semoga semuanya selalu baik-baik saja dan selalu dalam lindungan Tuhan yang Maha Amin, amin, ya robbal alamin Oke, okay. ya kali ini kita kembali lagi kepada Mas Ali Bata Dan kali ini ada lagi reaktor terbaru yang sangat sombong untuk pertama kalinya mereaksi Mas Ali Bata Dan seakan tak percaya bahwa Mas Ali Bata bisa memainkan Lagu seindah dan secepat seperti yang Mas Alip Bata biasa mainkan. Oke, daripada kita penasaran, pengen tahu seperti apa reaksinya, mari kita langsung gas ke videonya. Back with another reaction and uh... man, alright, this video ain't gonna be for everybody, but if you like, if you like music, <laughs> then I don't see how you can't like this. Especially if you're a guitar player. Hello and welcome back to the channel. It's time for another Alip Bata React. Hi guys, you're here again. Yeah. Welcome to YB Plays Music. I'm continuing my Halloween special series reactions with this one being Alip Bata with his version of Goosebumps. Yeah. Goosebumps. It's not the song as I have stated in, in a previous reaction, um, but it's apparently the theme song from Goosebumps. <laughs> okay, first thing I got to figure out is the tuning. Yeah. That's called dropped D. So instead of an E, it goes to a D. And it just l lends itself to a lot of compositions. Okay, it sounds like he's kind of doing some pulling off there, which is like pulling off the string. You go, you go like that. What the hell? <laughs> okay. That was different. There is already a lot happening in the first like 10 seconds. Okay, let's hear that again. Uh. Man, as a guitar player, this get like this gives me a headache. <laughs> 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 Very interesting. It was actually some kind of pull-off technique that he uses yeah. uh, on the on the upper string, which gives it more like a bassy sound or more like an aggressive playing sound. On the upper string, uh, it vibrates heavily. Let's say very interesting musically wise or melody wise. Okay, let's keep going. Okay. There's a lot going on just in that little part. He's doing, of course, the tapping, so you're taking on the part of a, a percussive oh, instrument. Oh. Now, I don't know the original song here oh. that he's covering, so I may be a little lost sometimes. So as you see there, he's able to hit, because now he's dropped his D. bass drop okay if y'all aren't listening to this on headphones right now turn like plug them in like you need to hear this on headphones i'm listening to them on uh these are uh what are these the astros nice change of rhythm
try to do that. That is not easy. In the same position, that is very quick to move your hand on like that. It's not too hard to play notes in that tempo quickly, uh, as long as you can use different fingers and to move them uh, over the arm of your guitar. But to stay in the same position and move it that quickly, that is not easy. Here. Ah. My God, what is this? This is like, it's like Latin shred jazz shred classical acoustic shred. <laughs> oh. Hold up. I'm sorry I'm pausing it, but I'm just like blown away by these riffs. <laughs> Look at his hammer off thing. Yeah. Such a nice piece of music. Yeah. to go into something different right there but I want to hear that whole breakdown again sorry Man, the hammer-on and pull-off techniques he uses in this video, he didn't play that, which is, of course, what hammer-on and pull-offs are uh, on guitar. But it's so smooth. He uses it in multiple different uh, sections in this song. And, and it just sounds like a very nice piece of music, the way he plays it. It's just so swiftly, very smooth, legato. Yeah. It sounds great that way. Some... Percussion in there. Yeah. I don't even know what these this sound is. Okay. Now I'm wondering, guys, because you hear the water running in the back of his uh, of his sound there. I think when he plays this, it sounds a lot quieter than what we hear through the headphones, uh, because you kind of hear the the the, the background noises uh, pretty clear. So I think he raises the volume a lot because all these harmonics are very hard to play loud. Harmonics usually are not very loud to play and definitely also with all these hammer on and pull off techniques it's not easy to really play that loud without strumming the strings so i think it's a bit like that so guys i hope you enjoyed my reaction to this one from ali bata terry makasi for the suggestion so thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like and share the video also don't forget to check out all my other reactions to ali bata and don't forget to check out my other halloween special reactions that i've done for this series and there's one more to go which is from nightwish so hype to see that one thank you so much for watching and see you guys next time bye okay mister terima kasih karena sudah mau memeriksa dan mereaksi covernya mas alibata ya dan wow bener-bener sangat seru sekali ya memang permainan mas alibata ini tidaklah biasa saja ya seperti yang kita lihat 
para reaktor ini sangat tercengang dengan permainan Mas Alibata dan begitu sangat sok ketika melihat permainan jari-jari Mas Alibata dan teknik finger style Mas Alibata yang sangat luar biasa ini ya. Wow, itu sangat luar biasa. Oke, mungkin cukup sekian dulu video saya kali ini. Kita akan coba sambung kembali di lain waktu dan di video saya yang selanjutnya. Untuk itu saja sudah dulu. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bye-bye.